While internal fighting continued in Russia, Russian forces in Ukraine continued their offensive. While the balances on the fronts are changing with the counterattack launched by Ukraine in the Ukraine-Russia war, Russia, which is in a difficult situation in Ukraine, is experiencing the biggest crisis of recent times with the coup launched by the Wagner Group. While the Wagner Group caused a great chaos in Russian territory, the Russian army continued its air and ground attacks in Ukraine. The general staff of the armed forces of Ukraine shared its daily report on the latest developments on the territory of Ukraine. The report included the following statements. Last night, the enemy launched another volley of missile and air strikes on Ukraine. Detailed information will be released later. Over the past 24 hours, the enemy launched a missile and air strike on Ukraine using 14 KH-101 KH-555 cruise missiles and three shaded drones. They attacked the city of Zaporinska with four S-300 anti-aircraft guided missiles. Air Defense Forces have destroyed 14 missiles and two drones. A Russian KA-52 attack helicopter and seven reconnaissance UAVs have also been destroyed. In addition, the enemy performed 51 airstrikes and 59 strikes using multiple launch rocket systems. Unfortunately, there are civilian casualties. The risk of missile and airstrikes throughout Ukraine remains high. The enemy is focusing its main efforts on the Liman, Avdiivka and Morinka fronts with over 28 combat engagements taking place over the last day. To reach all actual news fast and reliable worldwide, please don't forget to follow and like us.